Hello guys, it's Avik here, and today I got a tutorial on how to create models in Cin in Ske Google SketchUp that you can also upload into Cinema 4D. So, as you all know, it's really hard to make models in Cinema 4D, so the best thing to do is just go into SketchUp, and I'll show you here, um, get rid of this lady, choose this, okay, so... The best, personally, I think the best option is to just make everything in SketchUp that you want to make and import it from there into Cinema 4D. So here I'll just make your average box kind of thing, box box figure. And you can also put your colors in. I'll show you that. I'll show you what, I'll show you what that does. So I'll have a blue here. I'll put in a red at the top and I'll put in bright green on the right okay so now you got your object whatever it is I don't really care you can just go to export file export and make sure you click 3d model now you can save as whatever you want I'm gonna save it as box and wherever you want desktop and make sure the format is collada file um, Cinema 4D only reads Collada files. It doesn't um, read Google Earth files. So you want to save it as a Collada file. It's .dae. That's the extension. And the options don't don't screw around with the options. Just leave everything that it that's already there there, and just click export. And it's gonna export to wherever you have it. Like I exported it to my desktop, so I put it, so it's right there. So now go into Cinema 4D and go to File. Oh, ah, not file open, file open, not file merge. File open and choose box.dae. And the scale, when it gets imported, it just it gets like what do you call it? It gets it's really small Google SketchUp models that get imported. So you might want to put the scale at like five or eight or ten. I'm just gonna keep it at eight for now. Spline division one, import 2D geometry yes, and the last two import animation and fixed transparency. Keep it as unchecked. And click OK. There we go. We got it in. Okay, so now you have your object. You have your full object. Like the back doesn't have any color because I never put any color on the back. Remember, but I only I put it on the front. And there you go. And basically, what happens is your whole animation, your whole um, Google SketchUp model gets imported, as well as your tech, your colors. So if you put in some nice colors in Google SketchUp, you can find them right down here, and you can screw around with them. You can change, you can add more stuff to them if you want, if you don't want. But all your materials get imported, all your material colors. So that's pretty nice. It makes it look much nicer. Trust me. So yeah, that's pretty much that for the tutorial. I mean, you guys, you guys will be, you guys are smart, so you'll be able to figure out the rest on your own. But that's pretty much how to import. Um, models from Google SketchUp into Cinema 4D instead of having to create models in Cinema 4D. Um, rate, comment, subscribe, guys. Thanks.